All right, let's get the official introductions underway. It's going to be our main event of the evening, and it's for the heavyweight title for the FFC. Heavyweight title to close out a great evening here in Daytona Beach. He looks Dakota leaner. Beach. He looks a lot leaner. Yeah, he's, he's a pretty big Ladies man. and gentlemen, <laughs> this is the main event of the evening. Three three-minute rounds kickboxing according to K1 rules for the FFC Heavyweight Championship title. Ladies and gentlemen, the officials at ringside are ready. The fighters are in the ring and they are ready. So Daytona Beach, Florida, let's see the war we've been waiting for. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he stands six feet five inches tall and weighed in at 280 pounds even with a professional record of 30 wins and only five losses he is a former k1 super combat glory and bellator competitor fighting out of middle beach south carolina he is stephen the panda Banks. and his opponent Fighting out of the red corner, he stands six feet five inches tall and weighed in at 263.4 pounds. With an official record of 49 wins and 11 losses, he is currently ranked number five on the Glory heavyweight roster. Fighting out of Zagreb, Croatia, he is the reigning, defending, undisputed FFC heavyweight champion. Scorpion Sting, the breast of us. And your referee in charge of this championship belt, Andrew Glenn. All right, we are set for our main event alongside Jane Park Smith, Rico Rodriguez, I'm Rich Quinones. Right, Should be a good one. You've got two fighters in there, two very big men. My goodness. I mean, first of all, Stephen Banks, you've got to get rid of the panda. You're weighing two, 280, you're 6'5". You're the big panda. <laughs> the giant panda. You're the man, giant panda. I mean, that. that is a big man. And then, of course, <laughs> Rostovats comes in, 32-year-old, 6'6", weighing in at 264. So, my goodness, heavy hands. A trimmed 264. Yeah, Just going to let you know. It's almost like saying jumbo shrimp, though. A trimmed 264. Let's Looks see the good. action. All right, Rostovats. Both southpaws. Thanks, White Trunks. Starting out early for Brett Savant. Oh. Impressive. Very flexible for two big guys. Absolutely. Those high kicks are, are something to know. Good outside late kick by Banks. Really moving fast for two heavyweights. of those hard-hitting hicks. Little jump punch there. Fake the knee punch. Ooh, good right up top. Wow, yeah. Oh. Good follow with a roundhouse. Banks is done, Banks is done. That's it, that's oh, it. Oh my goodness. Banks looks like he's done. Two, three. Where he got, where he got kicked. It just totally threw off his equilibrium. He is hurt right now. Delayed reaction. Wow. I think it was just on the top of his temple, so to speak, with the shift. Amazing. There's another one. Hey, okay. he's still fighting back. I have to give him credit for that. See if he can weather the storm, get out of here with a buck 28 to go in round number one. He looks dazed. You can tell Very he's hurt. Days. Just hasn't got his legs on the knee. No, not at all. Not at all. That's what happens. It throws off your equilibrium. Rostovats realizes he's going for the kill in round number one. An uppercut. Good combination. Needs to get out of that corner. Keep your hands up. Keep your hands up. Come on, hit him back. Definitely uh, hit him back. needs to bring some more action. And knee. Yeah. Several knees now. Ooh, combination. Very crisp. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
See, that's a, an athlete that knows when to open an attack because he wasn't putting a barrage of punches together. He's just waiting for the opening. Left roundhouse, got him again. Straight to the head. Great the job. Is getting back up. Twelve seconds to make it out of round number one. Oh, Ooh, comes good back. combo by Banks. Taking Brustamax's wow. best punches. Knocked down twice in round number one. Wow. <laughs> Very good action in round number one. I'd say. I mean, you have to wonder coming against someone like Brett Stavats if, you know, just simple things like his travel being delayed, 24 hours and waiting at the airport, and all those things all play into what goes on here. But I will say he is persevering the storm and doing quite well with that. But. Um, I mean, Laden is coming back from a disappointing loss of Paris, so he's not one to go home without uh, defending his title to the utmost. So right, Glory 28 really in Paris. Yes, yeah. yes, absolutely. Head kicks had just been on point. Oh my! You can almost and hear the rattling. What's interesting too is remember now with the rules. One more knockdown, that would have been it. Three knockdown rule. We saw two Is that in effect one. in a row? Just that, in a row. In, in the same in one round. round. Right. In one yeah. round, correct. Right. It's also accumulated two. Whole match, four knockdown rule. So again, say he were to get knocked down twice more, it would be referee's discretion to call a fight. It seems to be coming back, though. Banks seems to be hanging in there. Seems to. Uh, Lonin is unloading right now. Well, I think he's got a good sweat going, so he's warmed up. Stop. Step back, guys. Step back. These are both big guys. Any punch can take any guy out. Mm -hmm. And also, too, when you're that big and you're that size, when you throw and miss or kick and miss, you're, you're going to exert a lot of energy. Ooh, good right up top. Mm -hmm. Set up by the uppercut, though. Thanks. Eating the punch, but coming back with a left outside kick. Every time you see a shot hit, you just see the sweat come, come off of each body part. He's definitely defending. They're still going through. When Russell Robots came into the ring early this evening, he just kind of looked around and said, wow, this is a big ring. He's never fought in a ring this size before. Banks again Banks in trouble. wincing at the pain. Throwing back a little bit, showing some heart. A lot of heart. Just missed. <laughs> Couple knees for good measure. Driving them in his gut. Doing a lot of uh, work. Oh, goodness! Wow, and he is trying to get back up. Wow. Mandatory. Eight count. That'll be the third knockdown of the contest. Six, seven, eight. I have to commend the fighting spirit I'm seeing right now. Absolutely. Really incredible. One more knockdown. It'll go down as a TKO. Big heart. Absolutely. Banks got to stay on his feet for 45 seconds. Straight left connects. Beautiful combination there. Uppercut, hook. Using his distance. Oh, and they're right again. Oh, there's a hit kick. Oh, mercy, that's going to be it. Oh, my goodness. Vladimir Brestovac retains his FFC heavyweight title. My goodness, Stephen Banks showed a lot of heart, but you just can't combat those head kicks. I'm looking, at, I'm looking at his body, and there's welts like someone took a bat against his body. It was amazing. Wow. Yeah, he took quite a punishing and is still getting up like a... Warrior. Absolute soldier warrior, yes. Great job. I just hope that we can see more of this in the future. You're looking at, again, give all the credit. 
in the world to the champ, but you got to give credit to the underdog here in Stephen Banks. He took, I don't think people realize, you watch his home, you watch it online, you, you, you YouTube, you look at some videos, and right away you th might think a fighter soft. No way. Are you kidding me? No one's going to be able to withstand or weather that storm. Right. We heard the popping down here. I saw the... Look at that. The water come off the body. <laughs> like I've never, uh, it looked like a, like a little cloud. Mm -hmm. I mean, look, this is totally different than MMA. And, and this is the reason why I don't fight it. <laughs> it's painful. <laughs> it's, it's excruciating. I mean, I know that I do this for MMA, but we train it. But this is, their accuracy is amazing. And the jabs, everything kind of set it up. Let's make it official. We'll go back inside the ring in a moment. Close out a great night of FFC 24 action here. I do want to just make a note that every single fighter showed such sportsmanship and professionalism in, in relating to Ladies one another. Ladies and gentlemen, and just, at two minutes and 42 awesome. seconds into round two, referee Andrew Glenn calls a stop to this contest, declaring your winner by technical knockout and still FFC heavyweight champion, Mladen Scott.